made some salmon the other night. I'm just gonna throw in some leftover salmon. So we just finished up the workout routine. I want to show you how I recover. It's important that after you work out, whatever you take in is going to help to not only maintain the muscle that you just built from that workout routine, but it's also going to provide the nutrients and vitamins that your body needs to function properly. That's why we call it a lifestyle and not just a diet because there's a lot of adjustments that's necessary that needs to be made and implement it into our lifestyle so that we can make sure that we maintain. So what I'm going to eat to help with recovery, I have pasta raised eggs. I'm going to add some onions, tomatoes, and spinach and mushrooms just to add some vegetables to my meal. And I'm also gonna have a Greek yogurt on the side. That's what I would make for breakfast. Or if I don't have any type of protein that's prepared later on in the day, I can implement eggs. It's not hard. We just make things harder than what it seems to be. Uh, the sacrifice is necessary whenever we are trying to reach our goal we really need to make sure that we're taking in the proper nutrients or else you're not going to see change your body isn't going to change and you're going to wonder why uh, everybody is different so some people they take in eggs some may some may be able to take an egg some may not but i'm just showing you what i would do so you could just visit my website and we can help you with a customized plan for your specific needs this is very quick and it won't take a lot of time I'm going to use a quarter of an onion. All right, we have some mushrooms on the side. I'm using white mushrooms. Sometimes I'll 
use portobello mushrooms or and it's all dependent sometimes if you yeah sometimes i'll use portobello mushrooms but depending on your situations you may or may not like mushrooms you can adjust it according to your needs so let's use i'm gonna use four of these okay so let's slice up some mushrooms That workout that I performed, it was fasted and it wasn't too high intense for me. Cut another quarter. So that's a half onion that I just added. And I also made some salmon the other night. I'm just gonna throw in some leftover salmon. Oh. I know it doesn't look. Those onions are killing me. Oh my gosh. Whew. And spinach is gonna go last. Throw the mushrooms in there. Now season it a little bit of Himalayan salt. and some non-MSG Sazon, just for a little fun. All right. Now, throw in the eggs. I had that on low, I had to turn the fire on. Now I'm going to prepare my Greek yogurt bowl using 100% grass-fed Greek yogurt. Use a half a cup of the Greek yogurt. Probably a little less than half. See, that would be a cup. This, I don't think that's a cup. And it's important to make sure that your recovery is on point, eating the right foods that are filled with vitamins and nutrients. Cause I mean, it's, it's, it's very important for recovery. If you want to look the way you envisioned you, first of all, let's get into the whole thing of genetics. Yeah, genetics does play a part, but with fitness, exercising, weight training, home exercise, it definitely helps to accentuate your natural body curvature. So as long as you're doing the right thing, you're staying healthy, you're eating clean, you're eating the best foods that you could possibly take in to make sure that you're getting the most benefits out of the vitamins and nutrients, that's, that's key. It doesn't have to be boring, it could be fun, and you can make it taste good. Again, some days I switch it up, some days I might do this, other days I might incorporate Ezekiel bread, so, it all depends on what I feel like eating and what I'm doing for my energy. I'm gonna sweeten my Greek yogurt myself with stevia extract, which is which doesn't spike your insulin and is a more it's a better alternative to sugar-free sugars. All right, so I'm gonna use two packets in this one. For some odd reason, this one doesn't have the bitter aftertaste. I thank you so much for tuning in. Please make sure that you're liking, commenting, and engaging. And this is the content that you enjoy watching. Engage, like, comment, let me know if you learned something or if you need help with something. You can always visit my website, magicsilverfitness.com. We have both online exercise plans and online meal plans. Again, I thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.